Hey, good news. Google Offers is now available on the iPhone. This is something they added. Didn't they add it to um, uh, Maps or is it? Oh, no, it's a standalone app. Standalone app. I just downloaded it for a show. Yeah, I'm going to download uh, this. So is, this is their Groupon. Which app is this? Google yeah. Offers oh, okay. for the iPhone. Is it Office? I was thinking. No, what? yeah, Google Office for the iPhone. Now that's what is we it need. Office, what's like? <laughs> this is like a Groupon. You get, you know, coupons off and, and all of that. Which is an old model, I think. It does feel uh, dated. Now, when SNH Green Stamps does an app, then I'm going to get it. You remember those, Leo? Did you have to lick those too? Oh, yeah. Mom would make G- me. Wait, wait, wait. Test here. Gina, do you know what an SNH Green Stamp is? No idea. What? No idea. S and H green stamp? <laughs> what? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. what do you think it is? Do you know what do you think that stands for? Just let's let's I... let's chat room, what do you think it means? <laughs> then there was blue wasn't it like blue some other stamp? There was goldism I... and gold gold stamps? Gold like that. Yeah, that was the worst stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Was it like a Willy Wonka chocolate bar thing? <laughs> You probably don't remember the days when gas stations would give you plates for for filling up, either. Plates, yeah, like eating plates. Like dinnerware. I feel like I've, I've like suddenly no. entered some like weird <laughs> like my entire reference of reality is off. What? No, a guy. It's kind of weird. You'd pull up at the gas station. A guy had come up to you in a nice white suit with a little hat and say, "Fill her up today, sir. Can I check your oil?" You'd pop the hood. He'd check the oil. He'd fill you up, and then he'd give you a plate. Uh, okay. Really? Am I, I Jeff, this was am I making this up, Jeff? Am no, I making this? Was, this was premium marketing, and actually there's a magnificent, wonderful book about the history of the great A&P, which was really the first chain store, and, and, and now we live in the era of chain stores dying. And the way they competed with each other was not necessarily on price because the law, little tiny mom-and-pop uh, grocery stores banded together to fight the chain stores as if they were evil. Gee, it's just like today, people against Google. Nothing changes. And, Nothing ever and changes. So, and, right, so they would use, try to get government regulation to stop it. So the government regulation against consumers' interest would freeze prices high, wouldn't allow you to lower prices. <laughs> so what they would do is they would instead give you these stamps. And you put these stamps in these books. Poor Leo and I would have to lick these You have to lick them. them. The then you would, your mother would take in 10 of these books and, you know, get a beach ball or something. Yeah. <laughs> Crap. Now, Kevin Crewell in the chat room is reminding me that grocery stores used to sell encyclopedias one letter a month. Yeah. So you get the funk. It was oh. Funk and Wagnalls, and you'd get the, the, the encyclopedia. Was it Funk and Wagnalls? Or Sesame Street. This month is brought to you by L. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, wow. and now, now get ready for this. Microsoft bought that encyclopedia. And it was the foundation for Encarta. Oh, Encarta. Who remembers yes. Encarta? I remember that. It was Collier. That. Was it Collier's? <laughs> premium marketing. So actually, uh, uh, one of the great moments of premium marketing was Sports Illustrated coming up with the sneaker phone. It was a phone yes. in a sneaker. And, and the problem was that people started buying, they wanted the phone. They didn't want the damn magazine. <laughs> And so they'd subscribe just long enough to get the damn phone, and then they'd cancel the magazine. <laughs> and there were warehouses filled with sneaker phones. And so Time Inc. found itself in the sneaker phone business. <laughs> <laughs> I always wanted a football phone from ESPN, but that's another story for another How day. the heck did we get on the S&H yeah, green stamps? how did we get S&H stamps? I, blue I mean, chip stamps. Nice. It was blue chip stamps. Uh, thank Blue's you, Web3370 in Keep the it. chat room. Blue chip stamps, S&H green stamps, and gold bond stamps. It came up with, a, yeah, the Google... Google offers. Oh, that's right. That's also Rand, Randy P. Drinking glasses in laundry detergent. Yes. Well, it's like it's, uh, Cracker Jacks. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Gina, you do know I, Cracker Jacks. I do know Cracker Jacks. <laughs> I know about Cracker Jacks. <laughs> well, let, me you, lady, let me tell you, young lady, the toys today are nothing like nothing. the toys. Nothing. Oh, you used to get actual toys. <laughs> we, got, we used to get cell phones in our Cracker Jacks. Now boxes. you get like a piece of paper <laughs> that says, this is a toy. Yeah. <laughs> Right, like here's a joke on a piece of paper. Yeah, that's a toy. there's your toy. I got your surprise. I got your surprise right here. How Next time I fill up, I'm disappointed really when the guy with the white hat doesn't show up with the plate. I still oh. don't get the plate thing. I don't get the plate thing. Well, because uh, it was incentive. You you'd go to the uh, get because uh, this was in the days, I guess, when there was profit in selling gasoline. I mean, incentive to stock up your kitchen cabinet? I, I don't understand. Yes. Like, oh yeah, you'd, you'd end up with a whole set of plates. You know, you'd end up with the SO plates. <laughs> 
were they collectible plates? Were they all different? Or no, they sack? were just plates. <laughs> it was a sack. This month we're giving away the you know the, the daisy the set. You had to keep going. It was a loyalty program, right? One plate. What's the big deal? But if you want to get the whole thing, you got to come every. Stars. There's a Pawn Stars episode about this, isn't there? Oh, I'm sure there is. It's got to be. American this is Pickers. why. This is why Jeff and I feel so disoriented <laughs> in the modern world. We, this is, I mean, this is just beginning. Gina, you're going to see this in 20, 30 years. I don't know, 50 years. You're going to see this because what's, what's happening is it's accelerating. So the disorientation that Jeff and I feel is minor compared to what you're going to feel like when you're our age. You're going to say, true, I yeah. remember when there was a Google. And they'll go, come on, when there a, were what? things called stores you used to go to to get things. Remember those flip phones and you press <laughs> numbers on them? To yeah, text? see, you remember that. You remember oh, that. Grandma, remember Grandma what's a phone? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's hard to imagine even what, will, what it will be like. It's true. Google's.